Good afternoon, Boynton Beach. I am your city manager, Lori Laveria, and just wanted to wish you a very happy and hopefully healthy and safe 4th of July weekend. A um, couple things I uh, wanted to just make sure everybody is aware of that the county has recently uh, made a decision through an executive order to close all the beaches in Palm Beach County. So our oceanfront beach park will be closed. We, we must comply with that. So beginning Thursday evening after sunset, where our park normally closes, the park will close and stay closed until Monday morning at sunrise. The, uh, all of our other parks are open. We still have restrictions in place for our playgrounds and our pavilions, and that's also required through uh, an executive order. So, you know, get out and enjoy the outdoors, but unfortunately it is going to be with, with some restrictions. Um, boat ramps are open. We're keeping our boat ramp open. The county has not indicated at all they care to close those or, or plan to close them um, for the holiday. So please be safe. Uh, use safe boating practices. You are still not permitted to um, anchor up at, at the islands or any of the sandbars and congregate in groups. Uh, and I do believe, I know our marine unit as well as the county will have several marine units and our fire rescue personnel out on the water for everybody's safety. In the meantime, we're spending the holiday weekend moving. City Hall is on the move again, literally, and we will be looking forward to opening up Tuesday morning on July 7 for you to enjoy your new City Hall. Uh, we're very excited about it. A lot of things to get moved, but uh, we're gonna be able to offer limited services coming come Tuesday morning for utilities and development and permitting and so forth. You will be required to wear a mask. The county has issued an order as well where masks are mandatory in any buildings and businesses, so forth. You will be required to wear a mask as you enter into the building unless there is an accommodation needed. Uh, we will practice social distancing. You will, we will make sure we keep you safe. Uh, we're, we're not gonna have people congregating closely together or anything like that. So we have uh, worked those procedures out um, and in the meantime, again, 4th of July, we had hoped and planned and budget for a beautiful celebration, especially this year being our centennial. And COVID has kind of put a, a damper on that for all of us. So uh, we are unable to do our 4th of July fireworks this year, which we all, uh, I know, will sorely miss. But your safety and everybody's safety is really paramount here, honestly. And that's what uh, I think was the right decision of our commission to make. So. In the meantime, please stay safe, enjoy your family, um, be smart and keep yourselves healthy and I wish you a wonderful holiday weekend.